August 12th, St. Clair, Abbas. On Palm Sunday, March 17th, in the year 1212, the Bishop of Assisi left the altar to present a palm to a noble maiden, 18 years of age, whom bashfulness had detained in her place. This maiden was St. Clair. Already she had learned from St. Francis to hate the world and was secretly resolved to live for God alone. The same night she escaped with one companion to the church of the Portian Cala, where she was met by St. Francis and his brethren. At the altar of Our Lady, St. Francis cut off her hair, clothed her in his habit of penance, which is a piece of sackcloth, with his cord as a girdle. Thus she was espoused to Christ. In a miserable house outside of Assisi she founded her order, and was joined by her sister, fourteen years of age, and afterwards by her mother and other noble ladies. They went barefoot, observed perpetual abstinence, constant silence, and perfect poverty. Once, when the Sarsian army of Frederick the Second was ravaging the valley of Spoleto, a body of infidels advanced to assault St. Clair's convent, which stood outside Assisi. The saint caused the blessed sacrament to be placed in a monstrance above the gate of the monastery facing the enemy, and kneeling before it she prayed, Deliver not to the beasts, O Lord, the souls of those who confess to thee. A voice from the host replied, My protection will never fail you. A sudden panic seized the infidel host which took to flight, and the saint's convent was spared. During her long illness of twenty-eight years, the Holy Eucharist was her only support in spinning linen for the altar the one work of her hands. She died in the year 1253 as the Passion was being read, and Our Lady and the Angels conducted her to glory. At Pope Innocent's request, the canonization process for Clare began immediately, and two years later, in the year 1255, Pope Alexander IV canonized Clare as St. Clair of Assisi. St. Clair is often pictured carrying a monstrance to commemorate the time she warded off the soldiers at the gates of her convent with the Blessed Sacrament.